So our mitochondria, what it does is it takes nutrients from the food you eat, and then oxygen you breathe in, and then it produces energy. And what they call that is ATP. That is the energy production of mitochondria. But again, we eat food, our body hopefully in digestion absorbs nutrients from that. We breathe in the oxygen, and our mitochondria utilize that for energy. And for your mitochondria to do that, I hope you can see you've got to have all those building blocks. What the reason I put this up here is it's one of the panels that I'll run in my, my practice. It's called a neutral valve. And it's blood, but it's also urinary. And what they're looking at, because you're probably thinking at this point, okay, well, how do I know? How do I know that I'm deficient in those building blocks? And that's a great question. And I, like I said, that's why I run that neutral valve, because what it will show me is if somebody is sufficient in those nutrients, if they're borderline, or if they have a high need. It will show that. And so I can supplement for that individual for what they need. There might be a high need in B vitamins, but they might be borderline in magnesium, and their CoQ10 might be sufficient, it might be okay. So it can guide us for each individual. It's very powerful in 